when I first started with all these guys, they all had lots of hair. And now they're bald and they've got no hair, so I'm coming out ahead of them by cutting their bald head for $11. <laughs> they don't even have to ask me how they want their hair cut because I know if they didn't like it, they wouldn't be coming here for 40 and 50 years. This is more than a barbershop, it's a meeting place for old friends. <laughs> Since I've decided to close lots of nights, I've stayed awake thinking, am I making the right decision? When's the last day going to be, Dan? September the 15th, buddy. Jesus. Wow. Hard to believe after all these years. I've been coming here since 1958. 1967. 1997. Three years. People come in here, they haven't seen somebody in 40, 50 years, and they run into them in this barbershop. Gerald, what have you been up to? Anything? I have. I'm 84 now. and uh... To have people that's been with you for over 50 years, they have to be more than a customer. Now, Billy, we got you looking good, buddy. You're looking like $2 million. They have to be a friend. I recognize these big ears. <laughs> <laughs> that's me. Through the years, everything changes no matter how big or small a little town is. This is no little town anymore. Everything has gotten so expensive. For a single barber working by himself, it's hard to make a living in here. And then my health failed me some of the last three, four years. I just can't take all day of standing like I used to. Well, I got the ears of LBJ. And you got the eyebrows that look like LBJ. He's probably your cousin. I just had so many good friends that come in here. I just, I am gonna miss the heck out of them. See you later. I, you, you're kidding me about uh, uh, September 50. You can't go. <laughs> all the guys that still come here, they're just all going to miss Danny. He's an icon, that's what. This place, this whole place represents the old Austin. Sure does. We've all had good times, real good times. And I wouldn't trade it for anything. I haven't made no money, but I've enjoyed my life. Really, really enjoyed it.